I must say, I like caramel, I like pretzels, and I like chocolate. Put them all together and, <laughs> oh yeah, what a treat. God, what did you eat? Really quite a simple recipe. You just need a couple of baking trees, a few simple ingredients, and some time. After greasing the parchment paper with either some margarine or some butter, it's time to lay out the mini pretzels. I use Snyder's, but you can use any brand of pretzel you choose. Set the tray of pretzels aside. It's time to make up some homemade caramel. This is actually simpler than it looks as well. Just a couple of sticks of butter, a cup of brown sugar, melt it down over some medium heat, and you're on your way. As you can see, it's almost completely melted. I'm not trusting the mixture, so I'm gonna add another half a cup of brown sugar, and I'm gonna to continue to mix that. Now that it's beginning to boil, we're going to continue stirring that for five minutes while it's boiling. It's time to pour the caramel over top of the pretzels. Then we're going to bake it for about five minutes at 350 degrees. At this point, we're going to pour over 12 ounces of chocolate chips. Cover that up with another cookie tray and let the chocolate chips melt. For about five minutes. Now you can see it's melted. It's time to smooth over the chocolate. Put this in the refrigerator for about three or four hours. And then we cut it apart. And enjoy. <laughs> 